with, with the whole Shaq thing. Okay. With Shaq saying you don't go to your uh, spouse and tell him everything. Right, right. And he's a big dodo. They'll be using it against you. So That's Shannon, what Shani did. That's right. why he hurt. He burnt. So <laughs> Shannon asked her, what do you think about what Shaq said? Uh, she said, first of all, and I'm not, I'm paraphrasing. He don't have nobody. So oh, why would stop. anybody listen to him? <laughs> She so She's like, funny though. She's she always funny. gonna be funny. Why That's am why, I listening to some man who ain't got nobody? That's why I keep telling y'all. Now I'm starting to think the person, the personality, the character that would play a Nikki Parker would probably be someone who is fighting for the underdog and would apologize if she needs to. You know, give us some time to heal. I will bet you that husband though. Uh, yeah. So she said she didn't agree with Shaq. Your spouse, you should tell your spouse everything. Well, she tells daddy everything. Yeah. You know what, y'all? And that, we, this could be another show, and I'm not going to go off into a whole tantrum. I don't think you should tell your spouse everything. Some people don't. I think you should tell them the important things. Mm -hmm. Things they need to but know. But I don't think your husband needs to hear every single little every insecurity. thought in your head. Or that he needs to tell you. Yeah. Be okay with that, I guess. Be okay with you that. You want your husband to come home, he got a haircut at the barber shop. You want him to come home and start crying and saying the mess the man messed up his spade. <laughs> you don't have to do that. You'll see that. Honey, honey, I sat in that chair all day. That man messed up my fade. But you don't want you to. You know how hard I want to get you, a nice fade. But you know what? A lot of there are a lot of couples. A lot of couples. He if he if he see like you got a dress on and you really don't look good, I don't him, want him to say nothing. You may not want him to tell you. And some women are okay with that. Some women are they, they are used to their husband being said, "Babe, they don't look good. They make your bottom look big." You know when we was at the restaurant and that waitress, she had the a couple of buttons. She unbuttoned. looked good, babe. I was looking at her. I we tell each other out. everything, don't we? I we was tell each other her out. And in fact, I was dreaming about her last night. Actually, when we was making love, I was thinking about her. We tell each other everything. That was, Remember, we tell each other that everything. That was a Martin and Gina moment when Martin was dreaming about Pam. You know what, honey? And he could, uh, he would wake up with a nightmare. What's wrong? What's wrong? Uh, uh, I just had a nightmare. You he ain't going to tell Gina that he was dreaming about Pam making love. You know your wife was trying to work out and lose weight. You know she's on a di uh, diet and she's trying to lose weight. That's, you don't have to tell her, to, uh, honey, uh, why, well, now, nah, until your stomach go away. Oh, stop. I don't really like it. But you got to. You do don't it. have to say everything. But do you. As but that's a, a whole nother. That's a whole That's nother. a whole topic. That's All right. Do you as the couple and now how far you need to go with that. Right. Mm -hmm. um, and I don't want to hear everything you talk about with your stupid girlfriends. If I'm a man. Okay. I don't want to hear about you talking about Denzel Washington. And about how sexy he was. Or and, Idris. And, or Idris. Oh, girl, you going to see Idris. Hey, honey, we're talking about Idris. Come on in. You my best friend. We talk about everything. You know what? Uh-uh. Uh -uh. He gonna be like, oh well, so then I get to come in and talk about Halle, Be uh, Halle Berry. Yeah, so I could, I see Shaq did get a lot of slack. You for will that. never look like Halle Berry. I you want me to talk about that? But you gotta see where people are coming from when they do make those kind of statements. When they make a blanket statement like that, we all can kind of assume. Yeah, he didn't. His his marriage didn't go well with Shawnee because right, he that's had funny. an affair, and he's right. And Shawnee what probably you, used everything you've told her. I know we've gone over our time, but he's right. Mm -hmm. What you tell your wife, she will use it she against will, you when she gets mad. Anna on The View. It's the truth, y'all. Anna on The View, she admitted. She said, I, my husband tells me a lot, and he's right. I do use it against I'm him when I'm it. angry. As long as he don't care that it's going to come back. And that's so he probably don't tell her everything now. That's why you're insecure when you play basketball with your friends. Thank you. You've always been short. You never was able to get rebounds. Does your friend Bob know about that? <laughs> Bob is sitting there. Bob, he told me that he don't like when you oh. always um, jumping up, going over him. Tell him, honey. And tell you him. Don't shut him down. He ain't telling you no more. That's why Shaq said that. Don't tell her everything. When you get don't mad. Don't you have to spill your heart to her. If your husband, let's just go on and say it. If your husband's private isn't as big as you like it. Don't put that out there. When you get mad, women, you know. It's going to be in his face. There are some things in your mind when you get mad, you keep it in because in the back of your head, you're thinking, when this argument is over, if I say that to him, I'll never be able to recover. You know He'll what? always have that in his head. Yes. I can't say it. 
I'm mad, I'm angry, I'm upset, but I can't say it because when we, I know we're not gonna always be mad at each other. Yes, yes. And when I say it, I can't bring those words back in my mouth. Exactly. And Same thing will, with him, and, with you. And they won't open up again for certain things because it will be against him. Nick Cannon said um, 70% or something, it was a high percent of women have an odor. Mm. And we all sat there and went, which baby mamas are you talking about? Right, because you got Because like you said like 70. So what, seven of them stink? <laughs> And what odors? So is he going to tell her? He's going to say, he didn't say 100%. So each one of them is going to get, I don't want talking about you. Right, right. Well, who are you talking about then? And I don't want to say nothing. And then when, because he said it, they're going to say, what kind of odor are you smelling? What is this? What's going on? Oh, so don't God. say nothing. Yeah, don't say nothing. And if you want to say something, it's a way you say Remember, stuff. Remember, I want you to, if you wanted to talk about that, because I knew somebody was going to follow up about Shaq's comment. Shannon asked uh, Monique. Yeah. Uh, let me see. Let's go back.